I'm glad we came in to get out of the rain. I was actually in this church yesterday. Oh, really? Входите от Зоме Лупто Весехрат. I came to see the church and the cemetery. I'm interested in how memorials and monuments reflect cultural values. I'm working on a project, so I wanted to see the Slaven Pantheon. I think it's important to think about what a society chooses to remember versus what we choose to forget, because that's what shows the real values and beliefs of the culture. Isa, did you see the large statue of Saud Shiva? Had did you see him cut him? Yes, I saw them, but I didn't know what stories they told or why they might be significant. They're beautiful, so I assumed that they are important. Can you tell me more about them? The statue is a sexual argument among Czech politicians. The other is a very important myth from Czech history, but it was never rediscovered in the Ninete and Century. Rediscovered as in actually found again, or as in falsified. The other is a fake. So of the four statues, only two are actually based on real cultural myths? Yes, that is correct. Is it easy to tell which ones are false, or do they all sound plausible? You will say, let's say if it's stop betraying co ut shide and vel contino editor. What is this first statue depicting? I see a woman pointing into the distance, and a man by her feet, looking up at her. His statue is of Libuse, the metahitel mother of the Czech people. Libuse was dead here dog her of a great king. She had the gift of prophecy, and true in a fire, vice vai. She had the gift of prophecy, and true in a fire, vice vai. But her were men in the land who had it not like being true by a woman, especially the king's here dog her, and he. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yes. The men slaimed to had to hide the tattoo, so to hide the libus of in the husband. The legend says to had to send her magic horse and told the men to follow it. If her ever the horse stopped, to her her husband would be. The horse stopped in front of a common but good farmer plowing a field and he became her husband. Interesting. So, which other story from these statues is based on a real Czech myth? He saw the show of a famous event from the battle between the woman and the man. After he was dead, the man took power. He hanged the woman. The woman formed a Roman settlement. A civil war broke out between the man and the woman. His statue depicts a young woman, Sarka Vucha Omade, a plan to seduce and turn him the man's strongest warrior, Stirat. She lured him to an abyssal land, gave him strong meat. Vchich ma dech im slep and pliable. As he slept, she killed him, as we see in the statue. Unfortunately, the woman lost. So if the stories of Princess Labus and the war between men and women are actual Czech myths, which ones are fabricated? The statue of the dead for brother is Vucha or and the German sword of Czech lands forever is falsified. He sought her shoes of a mouse bard vuhao, after the war between the sexes, was broke her. The man wanted the bard to sink a great son kabo ut tkeirovit story over the woman, but the bard did not want to do it. Instead, the bard sank the most beautiful son kabo ut vysechrat. After he finished, he broke his instrument and vowed never to sink or play again. His story is poetic, but unfortunately, it is not true. Thank you for sharing these stories. This is fascinating. You are welcome. Shall we continue editor?